Well, there are tears of joy, I would hope. Yeah. Uh, we do have a voice note for you from uh, Zimkita, Kellen, one of your big fans. Let's hear what Zimkita has to say. Good morning, Zimkita. Morning, Expresso. My name is Zimkita Martin. I would like to find out from Callum where he gets his inspiration to write his music from. Wow, wow, wow. I enjoy your music. Loving the shirt. Loving the shirt, sir. <laughs> Yes, yeah, Zimkita, shoot Thank your you, shot. Thank you, Zimkita. Shoot your shot. I love it, and I praise her for it. Um, inspiration, uh, just from, from life, yeah. from, from living life and from falling in love, falling out of love. With me, it's falling out of love more. Right, right. It. Those so heartbreaks. That's, that's yeah. how you make good music. That's what they say. That's what they say. You stay heartbroken. The title of this next song kind of paints an epic picture for me. It's called yeah. Biblical. Tell Bib me about writing that song. So Biblical um, is a, just a song about unfathomable amounts of love, a biblical proportions of love. Yeah, yeah. And when we were in lockdown, uh, like I said to you earlier, I was, I was struggling a bit with my, with my mental health. And um, Biblical was a song that my uh, producer, John McGuire, was working on, who I wrote You Are The Reason With. Mm -hmm. And he said, look, I'm writing this song with James Bay. Um, oh, wow. It's called Biblical. We've, we've written a little bit. Let me know what you think. And he played it to me, and I was just like, just so full of motivation again. Because yeah. I'd lost all my motivation during mm -hmm. the lockdown to write the album. And that just reinvested, because hearing a lyric like, I want to have it all with you, it, like you said, it just paints that really vivid picture, and then it just made me fall in love with writing again, and Biblical and Rise are the two songs that I wrote in lockdown, so it's quite fitting that we've performed them for you on the show. Cannot wait to hear it. Well, here he is, Callum Scott on your Feel Good Breakfast show with Biblical. So hard, then my feet left the ground. Gravity don't make no sense when you're around. I come up against myself when demons in my head get loud. I don't know how you do, but you turn them down. I slip around the
Come on, man. Yo, the book of love, chapter one, verse one. Right here, fam. Ah, <laughs> oh, listen, that's absolutely incredible. Um, Thank I, you. I can't get over just, the, you know, the, the, the growth and the progress uh, over the past couple of years. For those who are going to attend the show yep. uh, in Cape Town, Durban and Johannesburg, what can they expect? Uh, we're just going to take them on a journey, bro. Yeah. We're going we're gonna to make them dance. We're going to make them cry. We're going to make them laugh with us. I think we've, we've created a beautiful show. Yeah. And it's got its high moments. It's got its energy moments. And it's also got its really somber moments for yeah. people to just reflect. I think for me, one of the most amazing feelings is, is that I've put out an album that people have digested. They've assigned certain music to their life whether it be walking down the aisle, their first dance song, mm -hmm. you're celebrating the life of a new baby, you know, all that kind of stuff. And then mm. they come to my show and they sing it with that memory in mind. And we all have these collective moments together. I think just to see people's, the light in people's eyes is just going to be phenomenal. Oh, man. And I hope that uh, once you're done with the show, that it won't be another five years until we have you back. I right? hope not. I mean, thank, yeah, let's, let's pray not for another pandemic. pandemic. <laughs> Very but, true. yeah, yeah. So good to have you. Thank Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, Callum Scott on your Feel Good Breakfast Show. Absolutely stunning. Let us know what you think. We'll be right back after these.